a check to the sidelines with Danielle Bellini reporting. Thanks, Jim. I get a chance to quickly speak with Coach McCarthy during halftime. Not much scoring here, so obviously Coach talks about wanting to move the ball specifically through the air. He feels like there are opportunities for big plays on the field, so he just wants to see his guys take advantage of them. Back to you. Thanks, Danielle, and now we'll go to the field. Well, a lot of good things happen on both sides of the football this time. How about that return by the return team? Good job, good blocking. Look at the speed of that guy running. They get the tackle from behind. They stop the touchdown. They face first down. The give to the running back. That'll stop the play right there. 27 gets the call on the run. That leads us to second down. 319. 319. Quarterback taking the snap from the shotgun. Nice catch. In on the stop. Now the offense is down here in the red zone or the green zone if you like to think of money. And it's a tie game. A lot of things you could do. They love to throw it in the end zone, but maybe they'll cross them up with a run. We'll find out. They're going back up top. And incompletion right there, but it really should have been an interception. Well, the quarterback can't get him open. He threw to the right guy that time, but the coverage was so good by the defense, uh, nowhere to get the completion. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Always a good job to pick up some yards when you're in the red zone. Nice throw by the quarterback, and he gets the completion. The Seahawks defense now is going to go nickel. Aaron Rodgers going to take it from the shotgun. Touchdown, Green Bay Packers. What a throw by the quarterback for a touchdown. It was just really nice. He threw it beautifully, right on target. Touchdown. The Packers now will tack on the extra point. Count it. The Seahawks are in shape now to return the kick. That'll be a touchback, and the ball will be placed at the 20. The Seahawks offense ready now to see what it can do. Russell Wilson has it under center. First and 10. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. Well, that was a nice job by the offense. It just puts them in a better position. Nice little throw and catch. Harvins lined up in the slot. Second and short. Lynch is taking the handoff. Brought down at the 41-yard line. When you're behind in a football game, all you can do on the offensive side is just go out there and thinking about making plays and picking up first downs, good job by the offense. Tate's lined up now as a slot receiver. Now first and ten. Looking across the middle, and they knock him down just a yard away from the first. When you talk about throwing the football into open space, that's almost always against zone defenses. That's what we saw that time. Good job by the quarterback throwing it in there. Second and two. Marshawn Lynch takes the football. Well, that time, the defense gets the tackle behind the line of scrimmage. Listen, I blame this one on the quarterback. When you see the defense in a situation like that, you must change the play. Don't waste one in the NFL. You don't get enough chances as it is, and that one lost yards. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. What a job by the quarterback, finding a way to throw that football and pick up another first down. They are marching down the field right now.
End of three here in Green Bay, Wisconsin. We'll be back momentarily for the start of the fourth quarter. We're back here in this low-scoring affair. Millers comes off the line now and lines up in the backfield. The final quarter underway now with this snap. Russell Wilson connects with Golden Tate. Offside defense. That's what happens when you try to guess the snap count. Play number six coming up on this drive. First down and ten. Trying to find an open man. And he's going to be brought down. Well, that's a good job by the defense at time getting the sack on the blitz. And when you blitz, you're taking a chance. You better get to the quarterback, and that time they did. Wilson's play action. No one in sight. Has the grab. Anytime your team is down, you're inside the other team's red zone, you look for one of your star players, your quarterback, wide receiver, or running back. They need to make a big play here. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Third down and one. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. The officials can't tell for certain if it's a first down, so they'll measure for this one. They thought they had it, but no, they don't. The offense back out on the field here for this fourth and short play. Tate's going to get set in the slot for this snap. And a run right up the middle. He's brought down. First down by the offense inside the red zone. Can the defense show him something different here and keep him from scoring a touchdown? This has been a long drive so far. So, first and goal to go. Lynch then picks up about three. This is where on the defensive side, where you have the lead, the team's driving against you, call something different so you can come up with a big play and stop the offense. Play after play after play here on this drive. Second and goal from the seven. Eyeing that left side. What a hit, and the ball is dropped. Well, they always say if you get your hands on the football, you got to make the catch. Yeah, right. The guy that made that rule up wasn't getting hit as he was trying to catch the football. Nice hit that time by the defender. Third and goal from the seven. Touchdown, Seattle. Anytime, Jim, it's third and goal, you got to decide, what are we going to do? Well, this time the offense, nice design. They throw the football, and the quarterback puts it right on the money for the touchdown pass. Been a great game, which is now tied here late in the fourth. Scores 7-7. Seven to seven. And that's a kick return of about 24 before being brought down. The Packers will come to the line. Still a very close game here in the fourth quarter. The scores seven to seven. Jones in the slot. First and ten. The throw to the left. Pass is made and it's incomplete. The hit jars the ball out. Good timing by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver just as the football is getting there and makes the hit and knocks that football loose. And he makes the catch just past the first down marker. Sometimes it's good protection by the offensive line, and sometimes it's just bad defense. They can't get to the quarterback, and that's another completion by him. 
Rodgers from the shotgun. Launching it deep. Oh, that could have been intercepted, but he couldn't hold on. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. The Packers have saved all three of their timeouts for here in the fourth quarter. Right where it had to be. The Seahawks signal for a timeout. They have two remaining. This play set up by the long gainer. First and ten. From the eye, they give it to the deep back. Spins away from contact. The defense stops the clock. Second down here. The quarterback hands it off on the draw. Spinning out of trouble. Defense calls a timeout. The ball carrier on the play. Five-yard gain on the play. Aaron Rodgers will be under center. Third down at two. Staying on the ground. And they're going to run it right. Spins away from the tackle. He steps out. When we were at practice on Friday, Jim, this team was working on red zone offense all the time. Well, here they are. It's a tie game. We'll see if all their practice pays off. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. They tackle him for a loss. This satisfying defensive replay is brought to you by Snickers. Snickers satisfies. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Offense lines up here. Second and goal from the eight. And they feed it to him again. They knock him down behind the line of scrimmage. Teams in the NFL spend about 30, 40% of their time all week long practicing plays in the red zone. So there's a lot they can do here. Let's see if they come up with something that works. And he drives it through for the field goal. Yeah, that was a good job that time by the defense. They were bending, they did not break, and all they did was give up a field goal. Mason Crosby ready for the kickoff. This one's not leaving the end zone. The Seahawks are ready to take over now as their offense heads onto the field. Takes a receiver in the slot. He'll fire it out to the left. That catch will extend the drive. The quarterbacks and wide receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them to throw and catch and just keep picking up those first downs. Now first and ten. Trying to work that left side. Nice catch by the receiver, but it still doesn't get a first down. The Seahawks come to the line of scrimmage in the fourth quarter and out of timeouts. Russell Wilson will take it from the gun. Thrown incomplete. Well, Jim, I can't say that's great defense. That's just a poor throw and a poor route run by the wide receiver. Third down. Looking for Percy Harvin, but it's incomplete. They call that the moment of truth. It's a beautiful throw down the field, but the defensive back, he waits until it's time to make that jump. He defends the pass. What a good job by the defensive back. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Watch catch. There it is. The game has come to an end. It was a good one throughout. Hotly contested right down to the wire.
Is every win sweet, or are the close ones that much more satisfying than just blowing someone out for 60 minutes? Well, the close ones are more satisfying because the tension is there longer. And the longer you're under tension, when it finally uh, comes to fruition, you win, it just makes it that much more exciting, Jim.